Do you ever find yourself typing the same things over and over again, especially long things where you could make a typo? Well, never again. Fast Keys is going to automate those repetitive tasks on your computer. You'll type in something really short and easy to remember called a text expander and boom, like magic, the longer thing appears perfectly. I'm public speaking coach and voiceover guy Milo Shapiro, and in this video, I'm going to walk you through the main screens and show you how to create a simple text phrase for easy substitution. Let's get started. First, we'll open the main Fast Keys window by clicking on the Fast Keys tray icon. You can also right click on it and select Settings. This is the Fast Keys setting window. Use the menu on the left to select a module. Modules are just different ways of starting the fast key commands you'll create. For example, a text expander, a start menu, a keyboard shortcut, etc. But let's start with the simplest case and the one I use most, the text expander. You can group similar shortcuts with tabs. And you can right click on any tab to add, delete, or rearrange the tabs. You can edit a phrase by double clicking and you can enable or disable it by clicking on the box on the left. So, let's create a new phrase. We'll click the plus sign on the top right to create a new one. This opens a phrase definition dialog. Let's enter the phrase we want to use here, like this typical customer response text. Next, we'll set an abbreviation string. We're picking a short sequence of letters that aren't a real word, so that typing this string will trigger the phrase to instantly replace it. I'll go with CCR for customer contact response. It's a good idea to also set a short description of the phrase to remind you. I'll name it customer response phrase. We'll leave the command mode set to the default, which is send, which means fast keys will insert text. There are other options available that you can learn about later. For now, let's just see this one through by clicking the OK button to save it. It can work in any software. I'll open Notepad as an example, and I'll type CCR, and Shazam! You can see how fast FastKeys expanded it. All day long, I type in short bits of text, and FastKeys turns them into something much larger, saving me time, making fewer typos, and making me more productive. But let's take this to the next step. What if you need to customize the phrase just a little bit each time you use it? No problem. We can do that by using a macro where you fill in the specific information each time. Let's try it on the phrase we just created. We'll double click on that last phrase we created. And better than saying, dear customer, we'd rather put their name there. So let's delete the generic customer and then click on the user input icon and select the manual text input. This opens a macro dialog. Simply give the macro a name like this. We can ignore all the other options for now and click OK. You can see how the new macro field was added into our phrase, right? So easy. Let's go back into Notepad and type our abbreviation again. You can see how it now opens up the input dialog so I can type in the name of the customer. After pressing Enter or clicking on the OK button, Fast Keys expanded the phrase like before, but this time, it says Dear George instead of the generic Dear Customer. OK, that's all for now. And this is just a taste of what you can do with Fast Keys. We'll cover more features in other videos. Check the description below for the links to Fast Keys webpage and publicdynamics.com about me. Till then, till next time, save yourself time and effort by getting started with Fast Keys.